Now here's a live view of the Soyuz spacecraft and the uh, support teams that have uh, gathered around it and are beginning to work with the, the hatch opening for the crew. Expedition 13 Commander Paul Vinogradov and uh, Flight Engineer and International Space Station Science Officer Jeff Williams uh, completing their six-month stay aboard the International Space Station with a landing on the Kazakh steps at 8.13 p.m. Central Time, just 15 minutes uh, before sunrise uh, in Kazakhstan. Yes, we're getting them out. Andre, help. Is everything okay? How do you read me? Russian recovery forces, uh, Commander Paul Vinograda first out of the spacecraft. Yeah, they were asking me, Anusha was asking me how long it's going to be, and I said, no, not much longer, another 10 minutes or so. Who's going to take the gloves and the headset and everything? Good job, guys. Thank you. And now Anusha Ansari, uh, the order in which they uh, arrived outside of the spacecraft uh, following uh, hatch opening after the landing. Okay, you step away. I'm sorry, receiving a bouquet of roses uh, on the ground, and uh, as mentioned from the landing site, uh, everyone looking hale and hearty uh, after their voyage uh, through the Earth's atmosphere. An apple? Do you like an apple? How would you read me? <laughs> And this is Mr. Troll Houston. Now our uh, first views of uh, Flight Engineer and NASA International Space Station Science Officer Jeff Williams from the Expedition 13 crew as uh, he munches on an apple along with his commander, uh, Pavel Vinogradov. At the uh, landing site about 50 miles northeast of Arkalek uh, on the Kazakh steppes, uh, a barren landscape, uh, very chilly temperatures. I feel like the Soyuz flight. Well, the flight was excellent. As predicted, as I had heard, uh, the, uh, the flight would go. The, uh, everything was nominal. It's a great deal. So it's a great spacecraft. Uh, what are your first impressions after a landing? I looked out my window and I saw the grass and I, I knew we were on the, uh, on the Earth. Uh, it felt good. It wasn't uh, too difficult. I expected actually more of a, of a bump on the ground. Uh, but it, it wasn't bad at all. Put the ground roll on side. <laughs> Any further questions? Do you want to add something? Uh, well, the flight was great. It, uh, it was everything I had hoped for. Six months on orbit, but Pasha was a great commander, great crewmate. We had a good first half. It was uh, wonderful to get some us on board with us. Halfway through, it was great to see two shuttle crews up there and to get the shuttle flying again uh, to continue the assembly. Uh, and then a week ago, to uh, after we got rid of uh, the, uh, the shuttle crew sent them back to Earth, we uh, had Expedition 14 and then Musha show up and uh, had a great week with them. Uh, really appreciate all the work that the folks on the ground did uh, to prepare us and also to support us the flight uh, in Moscow, in Houston, in Huntsville, and um, now Munich. Uh, Everybody did a great job. Really appreciate that on a personal level the support uh, that friends and family have given to my family and to me. Uh, just, uh, it was a, it was a, a joy to, uh, to bring the experience to a lot of people. And that, that was my objective. Uh, hopefully, uh, people to join us on the journey. I would like to say thank you. Thank you to everyone in Mission Control Centers who were supporting our flight. We're still working 
with increment 14 now. I don't think we would have been able to do anything, to achieve anything really without support from MCC Moscow, MCC Houston, from Huntsville. Uh, we are just the very top of a huge iceberg. Thank you very much. We enjoyed working with everyone. Я <laughs> <laughs>